The Woodland Christian Cardinals are undefeated on the season, earning the top seed in Division 7. Ryan Doherty is great on defense for the Cards. And Woodland Christian set to face a LeGrand team looking to make a grand entrance into the Division 7 title game as the third seed. Quarterback Julian Buccio has over 2,000 yards passing this season for the Bulldogs. LeGrand and Woodland Christian, it's the D7 matchup played at Sac City College Friday afternoon. Parker Ream coming to you from Hughes Stadium. The Cardinals looking to use that two quarterback system that's worked all year long, but in the first quarter, it was LeGrand's singular QB that struck first. Julian Busio drops back and a beautifully thrown ball finds Jeremiah Lopez for the score. Extra point is no good. 6-0 Bulldogs early. Next drive, LeGrand going for it on fourth down. It's that connection again. Julian to Jeremiah, the toe tapper, keeping the drive alive and would lead to this next play. It's Louis Agallo taking it in from two yards out. The two-point conversion is good and the Bulldogs take a commanding 14 to nothing lead early in the game. Woodland Christian trying not to let this championship game slip away. Plays like this will help. Jonathan Jaime, what a grab, but the LeGrand defense held strong and forced a turnover on downs. We jump to two minutes to go in the second quarter. Busio takes the snap and Reyes Diaz comes back to the ball and he is gone. Up the sideline he goes for the score. LeGrand takes the 21 to nothing lead into the half. Third quarter, it's Caden Pasco at quarterback trying to jumpstart this Cardinal offense, but the Bulldog defense was stout Friday afternoon. Isaac Davison comes through with the interception, but both teams were trading blows in the third. And finally, with a minute to go in the third quarter, Woodland Christian converts Billy Hinkle with the three-yard touchdown run, 21-6 after the block PAT. Now in the fourth, Woodland Christian, their defense holding strong. Busio launches one, but Daniel Noschke is there for the interception. The Cardinals were in business in this fourth quarter. Could they come back? But on fourth down, on the ensuing drive, the pressure from Cameron McCloskey and Hernan Cortez gets home a sack. Sets up the Bulldogs with excellent field position, and they would convert. Agallo getting his second rushing score of the day to put LeGrand up 28-6. to Then, with six minutes left in the game, the Bulldog defense calls game. It's Ronnie Ramirez. I think someone's calling. You guys know which phone. The house phone. It's a house call to seal the deal. Congrats to the Bulldogs, your CIF. SJS D7 champs. So we saw what the record was, you know, and uh, it was, it, it's a big, it's a big deal when you go to a team that's undefeated, you know. The, you have to play with the chip on the shoulder, you know. So it's like coming into this game, we had to, we had to really focus up and believe that we could do it, you know.